Day one of the 2024 Doozy Canoe Marathon got underway at Bishopstow Hall this morning. Exactly the same start as last year. The paddlers started with a run down to the river. The racing on the water was just as hot as the weather offered, with the leading men's crew of Msawan Kosium Tolo and Sponelo Quella setting the early pace. They held that lead for the majority of the first stage to finish day one in the first position, but just 26 seconds behind them. In second place, Doozy legend Andy Burkett along with his partner Matt Fenn. In third place in the men's race, that went to Bongani and Tinga and Sandile Ngobo. Plenty of action still to come with day two ahead of them. In the women's race, it was much more one-sided. Abby Soames and her young partner Jess Ben managed to blitz the field to finish nearly nine and a half minutes ahead of second place Bridget Hartley and her partner Hilary pitchford Bruss. Third place went to Jenna Nisbet and Nikki Burkett. But there is so much racing still to go on day two. We know that day two is a paddler's day. Plenty of work to do for those paddlers. The runners might find themselves wanting a little bit, but there's going to be action aplenty as we head towards the finish of day two at Ananda Dam tomorrow. So with a little bit of a big gap uh, to end, but unfortunately we didn't get much. We didn't get much. But yeah, we, we can't complain with that. Uh, tomorrow anything can still happen to anyone. Oh, finishing 20 seconds behind. Um, I think you can't, uh, can't argue with that for day one of Doozy. We probably could have lost a lot more against the pedigree runners we're up against. I think it's more of a smile of relief to be here. It was quite a brutal day with the running, you forget. But um, no, it was nice. It was, uh, it was broken up into so many different stages today, which is interesting with these last three little portages that we don't usually do on day one. So you always had to think ahead and keep something in the tank for this last bit. But I think that's where we came into our own and really put the hammer down. Oh, day one's always pretty tough because um, I always try to be a little bit conservative in the beginning, but now with a change in the finish, you kind of, your we have tripped it, but your brain kind of plays a bit of mind games with you as soon as you get to Doozy Bridge because I think our, our bodies are frozen to finish there. Um, but otherwise, yeah, it, it was a good day, but it got hot quite quickly.